good afternoon cadre. So I am currently uh, working some night shifts covering. So it's going to be afternoon shave today. Just got up a little bit ago. Uh, yeah, so we are officially into the uh, Williams 3017. So I've got my Silly Willy here with the crazy aftershave mix, which is what I'm using for my aftershave. So. It matches, yay. <laughs> uh, yeah, so beyond that, today uh, we are still doing, or we're also doing the um, February One Blade Challenge. So I am, uh, what's it, six? Will, uh, this will be shave five on uh, my Feather AC Blade and the Occam Razor because I missed out on a shave on Thursday, I think it was. Just didn't end up happening. So, anyway, gonna use Omega Bore today to lather up. So, I'll get that going. <clears throat> yeah, so, uh, like I said, working some nights this weekend to uh, help cover things. And, uh, let's see beyond that. I think we've got uh, sign ups are supposed to open up on Monday for the next bingo game, which KJ, Mr. Spider, has uh, assured us that it will be something exciting and new and different. So, I'm looking forward to seeing what that is going to be like. Um, but yeah, so, <clears throat> hadn't really been a little checked out the last couple of days, just uh, lots of stuff going on. <clears throat> So I hadn't been on the forum a whole lot. Tried to get caught up last night a little bit. Uh, let's see, the weight loss challenge is going pretty good. So the first month, I lost 15.8 pounds. So that was pretty good. Congrats to Barbara Dave for losing the highest percentage for the month of January. And uh, we're keeping things going for February. So, like I said, things are going pretty well. I'm actually uh, decided to go ahead and try doing, since I'm on night shifts and whatnot, I'm not going to be cooking a whole bunch for the family this weekend. I uh, thought maybe I would try doing the extended fast. So, <coughs> started last night about 9 o'clock. And so far it's going pretty good. It's... Uh, yeah, so we'll see. I'm not sure if I'm gonna, exactly how long I'm going to take it. I think my goal is to try to hit a 48 hour. So far, it's going pretty good. Not actually feeling too hungry. Just trying to make sure I get some uh, electrolytes in. Because I'm drinking a lot of water. And then also some, I uh, had some Earl Grey last night and some coffee, but that's it. Dogs are going a little nuts, I'm the only one home, and they think every single noise outside is somebody coming home. <laughs> So uh, had a lot of fun this past week with the um, TSC game night. We did our first D and D adventure, being led by Mr. Doug Keister. He was very patient with a whole bunch of us because uh, almost none of us had ever played before. Myself, pretty well included. I played like one game of an entirely different system. Uh, you know. A long time ago, so basically, 
not counting that as actually having any experience. <clears throat> Beyond, I know how to roll a die, which everybody should know how to do that, so. Um, but yeah, so we had our first night, and, uh, you know, we nearly all died, so that was great. <laughs> but, we managed to eke by and survive, except for a couple people who will be making new characters. But, you know, that's just the way it goes. <coughs> Looking forward to next week and see where we go from there. Um, kind of people being allowed to make any little adjustments since it's all our first time playing. We don't really know what we're doing. So some people might adjust a few things here and there. We'll see. Yeah, so, getting a pretty decent lather out of the Altered Williams here. It's not the thickest by any means, but, I mean, Modern Williams hardly ever is. Super duper dense. But, it is very slick, which is the most important thing. So, really been enjoying the last week of shaves with the Occam. Definitely gives a very, very close shave without getting uh, or feeling too terribly aggressive. And I mean, half the time I barely feel it anything at all. I can just hear the hairs getting removed. That floating blade seems to really play nice with my skin. And uh, yeah, so basically from the very first shave I've been getting really nice smooth shaves with the uh, Feather Pro AC. And yeah, this is uh, the Feather Pro, not, uh, not a guard or anything like that, or a super. Kind of the standard one. Pass one. And uh, yeah, so. Alright, I may go ahead and just speed this up for the rest of the shave. Because, uh, yeah, not a whole lot going on since last week. I know I uploaded my video on Monday because I totally spaced it after I recorded it last week, so. Hopefully I don't pull the same thing this week. I'll get this up later today. So we'll see you guys at the end.
so that is my shave today. I uh, kind of try to show you guys. I uh, had a pretty decent amount of little, uh, lather left over in the brush from the Williams there. So I'm going to go ahead and hit the aftershave real quick. Uh, so one thing with this, you know, big mix of uh, various aftershaves and whatnot, I don't remember everything that's in there, but there is a decent amount of stuff with menthol. And quite a bit of that is very present in the soap. It's got a nice cooling effect. It's not like super duper ice cold or anything, but it's definitely a cooling soap, which is nice. And the aftershave is even more so a little bit chillier, which is also nice. Um, yeah, so that is the shave today. <clears throat> An update on where various things are at. Uh, yeah, so I am UA Cowboy over on the Shaving Cadre. Come check us out. Great group of guys and uh, gals and uh, lots of stuff going on. So, catch you guys later.